Hello everybody. It was just yesterday when we were talking about the all program express entry draw. We draw number 251 and today Canada has conducted the first ever category specific draw. So yes, this was something which we were talking since last one year and finally this has happened after the announcement last month. So as soon as summer has started, they have actually conducted this draw. So this draw today was in specific for the healthcare workers, number of invitations 500, cutoff score 476, tie breaking rule November 12, 2022 at this time. Now this is the first ever category specific express entry draw only for the healthcare occupations. They did announce some other categories as well and we have some news for that in store as well. So this is just a short video and I request you to stick till the end of the video to know more details about it but talking about this draw in specific this was for healthcare occupations and down below they have listed all the knock codes so all those knock codes that were declared earlier have been listed here so they have picked people from all these different knock codes and then their scores should be above or at least same as 476 so for the first time ever we now have some insights on how they're planning to do this not just this, we have some announcements from IRCC coming today on the next draws as well. Probably this has happened for the first time as well that they've announced in advance about the next draws. So today they published two different news releases. The first one is for the healthcare workers and this is something which should catch your attention. The first round for category based selection will open today and will invite 500 healthcare workers to apply that we just saw. The second round inviting 1500 workers to apply will take place on July 5. So next Wednesday, July 5th, we are expecting another draw for healthcare workers and it's great that they've announced number of invitations in advance as well. So when here they issued 500 invitations, the cutoff score was 476. I expect that when they issue 1500 invitations, the cutoff score would be much lower. Now looking at the CRS score distribution, it's just not possible to predict it because it's not based on the knock codes. But I would still expect that it would be much lower than 476. Okay, so this was about the healthcare occupations. What about the STEM occupations? So STEM was also one of the categories that was announced last month along with the healthcare. And here they've announced that next week on July 5th, they would also include STEM occupations as well. They haven't included the number of invitations here. So it could be 500 or it could be 2000. We really don't know about that. It would be very interesting to know about that. But it seems like we now know something about the next draw, which is going to happen on July 5th. So yesterday when we saw the all program draw being conducted, the cutoff score was 486. Today the healthcare occupations draw only issued 500 invitations, but that brought down the cutoff score to 476. Next week, 1500 more invitations are coming for the healthcare occupations, which is making it very interesting. The cutoff score for the healthcare occupations is going to go down for sure. And of course, we'll see at least one more item in this list with STEM occupations. Not sure about the number of invitations. And of course, without that, we cannot speculate the cutoff score. But yes, this is a really good news for all those people who belong to the healthcare occupations and who also belong to the STEM occupations because even if you have lower scores, you can expect getting the invitations in the next few months. Next week is going to be exciting and interesting and hopefully after that week, we'll get to know more about these draws. We'll have a better understanding of how they plan to conduct these draws. I'll regularly make videos on these. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, Please click the subscribe button before moving on to the next video. Thank you for watching this video.